Superset King, aka Mr. Get Your Tank Top Ready. We back. I'm back with my uh, shoe partner in crime over here, Mr. Buckner. <laughs> I know it's been a minute, but you know, we've been getting it in, you know, getting it in, tank top ready. But, you know, we want to talk about these upcoming shoes. What are we talking about? Upcoming shoes, 2024, 2024 yeah. 2025, you, yeah. you know. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to let my boy, uh, first, before we even get into all that, we're going to talk about some shoes that we done picked up recently. Right. I know it's been a minute since we got to y'all, so we'll talk about recent pickups. Me, I ain't picked up much. You know, I haven't been like my boy over here. My boy, they got it going on over no, here. No, no, no. That's, so, that's fake news. Uh, we're gonna say, <laughs> thank you. That's so we're going we're gonna to let him start it all as far as, like, shoes that he's picked up so far this year. Yeah, most of the stuff I got, I get for my daughters. Uh, them, them Jumpman uh, 11s, the, the, not Jumpman, Jumpman Jam 11s, the Space Jams. Yeah. I, I'm not an 11 low guy. Per se, I like the playoff eleven lows, the the that, but the patent others they look like girl shoes. Hence why I got them for my daughter. So true, true, they, true. those. But for me, as far as me, I got the military four. Pull well, them out. Let, see, let so them see what we're talking about. They, they give them a visual. Okay. Yeah. So yeah, pull them up to the yeah. camera, man. Let them see. <laughs> no, I'm showing the back, right? Military hey. blue four. Military yeah. blue four. I passed on it, and I'm gonna tell you why I passed on it, my boy. Okay. I messed right. around and saw it. Somebody had it early and I saw it. I touched it and I was like, am I getting this shoe because I really want it or I'm getting this shoe off of GP just because they complete the pack? And I'm not going to lie to you. I could think of like two or three other shoes I'd much rather have. And I, I that just, that was all I met. And I feel, I'm, I'm good with that decision I made. I, I mean, I understand. I, but to me, looking at it, yeah, it it won't well, last with me when it comes to the, to OG. To OG, for, okay, I got that. But from an execution standpoint, as far as what they've been able to do with the four, like as far as trying to get Shakes them back, and everything. Yeah, yeah, that's that's probably the, that's probably the most. It's closest to, a, a, in my opinion, you know, well executed and all that good stuff. It's it's the best we probably gonna see. You know, I think from now on they'll probably be modeling them after that after that four. I mean, I could be wrong, but that's what I think. I yeah, think. Yeah. So we got. I can't. I can't remember the nickname for this shoe. Man. I'm getting old. Like I used to know them all, but now it don't even matter, man. If it, I, it's a it's a nice looking shoe. That's your time. That's 0506. Oh, so, yeah, something like that. Okay. I, I, yeah, I forgot what they call them. And lastly, I think what's, what else you picked up? This oh yeah, this this bad boy right here, the the the, the one everybody that got confused about, complaining about that this this thing right here being naked. Powder powder yeah. nine. Yeah, Ooh, look. that yeah details de details I, yeah. A, another one <laughs> another one I like, but I'm be honest with you, if I had to choose between that and the olive nine, I'm I'm thinking more of the olive nine. Oh yeah 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 no no because no. I got a lot of Carolina blue colorway shoes. Yeah. And so it's like, okay, do, is this like a neat? So you get to a point now, uh, I tell everybody, all real sneaker people go through these phases where we get, 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 get. Yeah, yeah. And then sometimes we'll pull back a little bit like, do yeah, I really? Because yeah. you got so many of the same colorways. But you know, that's that was a mistake for me when I told you about that 13, that Flint 13, that black one. I regret not getting that black. I mean, to me, I don't, I'm a guy where... If That's it's a not nice. a that was a very, very nice shoe. New colors don't really excite me. They do me. New, they don't how they come out. New colors don't I got an really, open mind. That, that's what I'm saying. They don't really excite me. If it's not an old retro, and when I say old retro, I mean like 99 I got to 06 right know, in that yeah. right. Yeah. If it's not an old retro, because them them old retros, they hit some bangers. They, like, they did. Those new colors they came out with back to back to back to back. All of them was nice. So from that era, or if it's not an original color, I don't have to have it. So when I saw the red flint, I jumped on it. I was like, okay, that red flint is nice. But if I could do it all over again, I think I would have passed on the red one and got that black one. That black one. I seen one of the kids at school. I, 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 no, I, I told you. I, I, I was review, like, man. I did a review on it. I told you. I, I, I say the most underrated shoe doing yeah, that year. Man, and see, if, if for those of y'all, I don't know if we ever talked about it, but what I do for a living, I'm a teacher. You know what I mean? So I see the, the, shoe, the kids see my shoes, and I see theirs. It ain't much that they have that I don't get. But when I saw somebody, I was like, God, dog, I should have got that shoe. You messed up. I, I, I did. You I, messed up. I did. You know, hey, hey, players make mistakes too. <laughs> <laughs> All right, my boy. All right. Yeah. All right. So uh, I guess now it's my turn. I ain't got but like one new something that I uh went in and got. Uh, like I said in my previous video, up late night, pastime for me, looking online, and I came across 
I came across Ooh. this shoe. You know that shoe. I ain't, I don't think I ever seen that in person. Yeah, this that's shoe. that Lego. That's yeah. that Lego. Well, I can't say can't Lego. say Lego because yeah. he's he's a magic you know, guy. You know, yeah, you can't say Lego because yeah. why? You know, I'm, I'm, it's my frat color, so you know. But yeah, so you know that's the reason why I got these right here. They stood out and, and they was on sale for sixty, not the one seventy. So I had to have them. Yeah. Y'all would be yeah. so surprised. I, sleeper, sleeper. Y'all would be so surprised <laughs> how many shoes I in my collection I done got from I say 2017, 18 back late at night, just scrolling online sales and stuff and just be picking them up. Like I I I it, that's the reason why I, I laugh when people start uh looking at a shoe and be wanted later, like, oh my god, oh my god, like man, I got this shoe for sixty dollars. Right. And now y'all acting right. crazy. But yeah, that right there was that that was that's the only one other than ones you know y'all already know I seen you picked up this year. Of course you know I picked up the uh I picked up the uh the the Mac and Roll, the uh, Mac Attack and I also picked up, you know, the four. And, yeah, and to be yeah, honest yeah, with yeah, you, yeah. I gotta be totally honest. I think that that uh military blue four I think that's the shoe of the summer. I think realistically that's going to be the shoe of the summer, in my opinion. I think that's going to be the shoe of the summer. But I think a lot of people are going to say that, that the, uh, the the black uh, fours are going to be the shoe of the year. But guess what my mm. shoe of the year is? Let me make all y'all mad. That Anthony Edwards one is my shoe of the year. Okay. okay. You can't change okay. my mind about okay. it. I know a lot of great OGs are coming back. They're going to retro them. But yes. the reason why that yeah. is shoe of the year one, like Michael Jordan always say, y'all like this shoe based off the way he played. Okay, okay, yeah. yeah Anthony yeah, Edwards played yeah. this year. He did, he did. And he did. that shoe was different. It was, it was like, it was a good different. It, it wasn't like I was just making myself like it. Like, I, the first time I saw that shoe, especially that uh, when the All-Star game one, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I was like, that's that's the shoe. It, it changed my mind, but I'm telling to me, it's the, it's the shoe of the year. You know what, man? It's it's so much stuff going. I I can't I can't have a shoe of the year. I I be naming them all all day long. I got you. I got My you. personal shoe of the year, obviously. At this point. At this point, that's that then already came out. Probably be probably be this military foe. Probably be and 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 I know you said the shooter. I haven't personally seen anybody wear it yet. I no, mean, I, have. I, I have, saw a guy. And I, I had, haven't it, seen anybody. And wear I it was yet. at peace with my decision. Yeah, and I saw a yeah. guy he had the. Uh, Jackie Robinson jersey on yeah, with it, yeah. And I was like, I looked down and I said, nah, I'm good, man. I think I think people are starting to catch on because at one point, um, I used to be able to wear a pair of shoes and somebody say, man, where you get them from? I like, do. I got them same time you got yours, yeah. but they be done warm out. People don't really don't wear, wear them out no yeah, more. I think they they're starting to kind of understand this culture, man. The only way you look like you're a part of it is if your feet look clean. Like no matter how old, like we was just comparing shoes earlier. Yeah. Like we get, we had what. 10, 11 years ago. Yeah. And they still look good. Still look good. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, okay, before we move on, I'm going to ask you a question. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do it. And this is for y'all, too. Sneakerhead test. When you look at that shack, must, okay, certain shoes, certain shoes is like iconic moments that we think about when you see a shoe. Like, what comes to your mind when you see that? Just that Shaquille O'Neal. You, when you think about Shaq, Shaq breaking the rim with the two. Yeah, that's it. No. Yo, that, that's it, yeah, though. That, sure. that him dunking and slamming that rim with used to break. So, and, yeah, yeah, yeah. But okay, we're gonna move on now. We're gonna talk about the upcoming shoes for uh 2024, and you know what we think about these uh shoes for 2024. All right, first shoe we got, my boy. We're gonna talk about this Olive Nine. Mm. I just got one word. <laughs> Fa. I, I I concur. Yeah. I and you know I talked about that when we talked about the shoes that we wanted to see. That was on my list. Number seven for me. The, the Nike uh, Jordan Nine Olive, the olive color. I know we're getting the, um, the 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 powders next year, but that olive is something. And I really wanted this one because that shoe dropped back in 2012. I was in line, and I don't own the shoes. That was on my list, the Olive Nine, yeah. because I missed it. I stood in line for like three hours back in 2012 and didn't get the shoe. And so I'm thinking maybe I didn't miss much because they had some quality issues back then. But I mean, just to have it, just to have it, because I never had it yeah, before. Had, yeah. But from what I'm seeing, they they taking it back to the old school. That's a that's a can't miss shoe. I think if it's made anything like that, powder blue nine, it's going it's gonna be yeah, it's gonna be nice. That's a non negotiable for yeah. me. See, certain shoes come out. That's a non negotiable. Yeah, that's a non negotiable. I'm gonna get that. One. Yeah, yeah, that's, yeah, that's yeah, a yeah, yeah. You're not, yeah, you get it regardless. But I'm I'm just saying as far as 
the more the better it is, the, the more we're gonna enjoy it. Yeah, that's so, true. That's true. Yeah, I'm, call I'm, is everything. I'm looking. Shoes. I'm looking forward to it. That's that's one. That's a shoe I've never owned. That Olive Nine, I've never owned that. Shoe. Me, so I never owned it. Yep. All um, right, next shoe we got the Black Cement Three. They said that it's yeah. not gonna be reimagined and old, and they gonna make it look like the old shoe. And I am ready. Non-negotiable, yeah, possible yeah. double up. Let's just be real about it. I've double up with them in the past. I got to have it if they now if they reimagine it, I don't want it. I told mm. y'all before I can't mm. do it. I, I'm done with these old mid so I'm yeah. I'm done yeah. with them. Yeah. But if they make that shoe look like it's an OG shoe, oh, it's double up. It's <laughs> oh, it's double up. I, I ain't up for negotiation. That's yeah. a double up for me yeah. in 2024. That's why I say I'm more selective about what I want. But that shoe, it it ain't no question. Maybe three, but I definitely two. With that three though, I'm gonna be honest. I'm I'm it's kind of sort of one of those things to where is it gonna happen? I don't know because I, they lied to us already. Said what, it was gonna be a black. That's cat. what I'm saying. But I'm gonna tell you what all this got to do with. Y'all don't want to keep looking. Y'all got to start looking at my videos. Cause I'm telling you, I'm like Nostradamus with this thing. The only reason why we reap the benefits of these shoes is because of Anthony Edwards rocking right yeah. now hey. with Adidas. I'm not mad at him because I'm he mad. rocking. Yeah. Nike is it got it. They got to catch up. They yeah. invested in John Morant. Yeah, I'm not mad at him. They got to catch up, and they're gonna catch up by keep throwing these shoes and they'll say, "Let's see what y'all gonna do now." And that's what we get because they throw this black cement at us. <laughs> yeah. But the reason, and that's the reason why I didn't think we was gonna get it because we just got one when it was 2018. 18. You know what I mean? I got mine, but guess what? They the it started browning up front. Yeah, 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 yeah. But that was supposed to be reimagined, not necessarily um remastered. I mean, not reimagined, remastered. Yeah, not that, yeah. Yeah. That. They, 2018. We got, we got Nike Air on it, so that's yeah. all we got. They, but you, I think when they really starting to hit, they started to kind of strike gold was with that um All Star joint, the, the red one. The the the, oh, yeah, the one I got there. So, yeah, yeah, I've been wearing it. Yeah, was, that's when they that changed, was, changed. That's what I'm saying. 2020. I never yeah. forget. I walked into the store, sitting still. Yeah, it sat so still that yeah. I looked at it, walked out, walked <laughs> around the mall, came back. I said, "Yeah, go on, let me get it." Yeah, I could. I'm telling you, the yeah. biggest thing that grabbed me was. Well, look at the shape on this exactly, thing. Exactly, exactly. Look at the shape on exactly. this thing. I think, I think if that 2018 black cement looked like yeah, that, oh, it'd have yeah, been game over. Oh, you yeah. know, because mine's still kicking. My red one. Yeah, I actually sold my second pair. No, of, of, the, of the 2018. Okay, when I got okay. the black cement three, yeah. so I'm only down to one. Okay, okay. Yeah, but but okay. you know, so but yeah. All right, we on to the next shoe. I know it ain't shoe you looking forward mm -hmm. to. A shoe was I was looking forward to a whole lot. That Andre Agassi Air Tech Challenge Two. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Man, they showed <laughs> they showed official images. Them shoes look like they in the Goodwill dumpster. You know how the Goodwill have a <laughs> bunch of shoes they'll put on there, reduced for a dollar with the shoe strain tied up together. Oh, that's man. what them shoes look like. It man. can't be that bad. It bro, can't be that bad, bro. Yeah, them shoes look like they already wore. Now, don't get me wrong. Yeah. The top looks right. Okay, okay. And then you get to the okay. bottom, and it's like it just it doesn't work. Like quit yeah. making these shoes age. Quit. We are going. Listen, listen. Let me explain something to you, Nike. I know you're not listening, but you need to listen. Oh, they listen. <laughs> Generation <laughs> X is going to buy these shoes regardless. Right, right, right. You right. don't have to worry about, uh, uh. well, millennials, y'all going to buy them too. Right. Gen Z and this alpha generation, you don't have to worry about them buying them. I know that's why y'all doing this whole age thing because it's a whole generation of people that want these age men. So listen to me. If that shoot, and I've had people who came make comments on on my channel is regarding the shoot that they were also disappointed. Who was tennis guys? They were disappointed that they're gonna bring this shoe out and they're gonna bring this shoe out age like that. Like a man so, said on my comment, he said we wait five years for these shoes just about every five years, right. and now they're gonna bring them out looking the way how the ones from five years go look now, right. old in age. Like right. it just, yeah. I can't do it. That's what I the reason why I feel the way about the Blacksmith Three. Yeah, I got yeah. one old in age. You yeah. gonna turn around and sell me one new old in age? That's true. Like, That's I true. mean, you gotta make that make sense. That's that that yeah. flip flop I keep trying. to Get the flip flop shit on me. I tell you, man, I just I, I, I just can't do it. But you know, getting off of that as far as uh 2024. Now we're gonna talk about the story of all stories right now. The George 17 has now this crazy buzz. Now I'm gonna uh toot my own horn a little bit. 
As y'all know, way last year, early last year, I said Jordan need to, because they talking about how stale Jordans are, everybody talking, I said Jordan need to put 1 through 14 in the vault and go 15 through, uh, whatever I said, 15 through 23. And I think the number, if I'm not mistaken, I think it was 34 shoes that they could actually come up with with those number 15 through 23. Right. And now they pulling this buzz out about this 17. Everybody acting crazy. Let's just be honest. 50%, not all, 50% of y'all don't even know much about these shoes. Right. right. You don't, you, 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 you talking about this particular shoe supposed to came with a suitcase? No, it don't. Call, it let me explain mid, right? the suitcase color. Yeah. Okay. I have the college blue one suitcase. Okay. And if you check my channel, like I said, I've done it on the, on the 17 before. They also had a red one, yep. red yeah, suitcase, yeah. okay? Michael Vick style for me. Right. And they had a black one, black right. suitcase. Right. These particular shoes that came out with the lightning, you call them, they had a face box and they had the dust bag. Now, the dust bags was fine. Right. They were they were, they were, fine. So, I don't understand this craziness. The problem I have is that people like me and a lot of other people, we really wanted this shoe. I was willing to pay the three hundred for this shoe, but I'd be damn if you think I'm finna pay six hundred dollars for a Jordan <laughs> Seventeen. Never, never. I keep telling you the yeah. same thing. Yeah. I bought used cars for five hundred dollars twenty years ago. Dang, you yeah. think I'm finna pay six hundred dollars for a Jordan Seventeen that I know is gonna sit in my closet? I will break it out in two years from now. No, no, right. no. Right. Yeah, and let me tell you how crazy the thing, how life goes. Right? Everybody ain't crazy about Seventeen. I want to say 2017 or 18, right? I want to say during that time. I could be wrong. Of course, sometimes I'll be wrong my dates. They had the Jordan 17 trophy uh, trophy room. Yeah, yeah. And guess yeah. the only reason why I don't have that shoe? Because I went to a place. They had it. It was only $200. Yeah. It was a 10 and a half. It yeah, was just too size. small. Yeah. Yeah. So you talking a shoe now that people want $800 for? That I could have got way back then for two hundred dollars. They were selling that shoe for two hundred dollars at a, at, a, at a shop here because nobody really was even checking for them. I don't understand, but I don't understand how that. It's not making sense to me <clears throat> that, that that shoe would even sit like that. I mean, I'm sorry, sell like that with everything else sitting the way it, it makes. It makes plenty of sense. I can tell you why it makes okay. sense. One, they limited the shoe. Okay. They limited it very bad. Okay. It wasn't like available at Foot Locker, your champs was only mom and pop places, right? So like Walters, Wish, Soul Fly places like that, right? That's one. Okay. So now you know it's limited. And what happened when you see a limited? You already know. I told y'all resellers run the sneaker game. So they they ears perked up. They, they uh, oh, okay. So limited. Next we got pretty much from there. You're saying, oh, it got the suitcase. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fifty yeah, percent yeah, yeah. of people don't know that one. I'm supposed to call the suitcase, yeah. but they just hear the suitcase, the yeah. suitcase. We're, we're I right believe here. you call whatever you want to call. I know how crazy people acting about this suitcase right now. You probably gonna see people right now wearing them shoes, probably with the suitcase what on the side. They gonna probably. I'm telling you, that's the, uh, because it's the suit. Listen, but, you made a hundred dollars just for that suitcase. But go ahead and blow their mind real quick. Like, how much was that shoe originally? Two hundred. So and with you and I didn't get mine on sale. And you, I got mine the day they came out. And you was paying for the suitcase back then. I was then. paying for the suitcase back, back then. Two hundred dollars. So, ladies and gentlemen, we pay two hundred dollars for shoes without a suitcase now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. I remember two hundred. You know that, we understand inflation yeah, and everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the most that suitcase. What I will yeah. say this though. It's still around. Yeah, no, <laughs> so it's gonna last a long yeah. time. And see, that shoe, the, the ones you're talking about that with the suitcase, I was in 12th grade when those shoes came out, 2002, 2003. And so back then, the new Jordans with the 14, 15, 16, 17s, they was only what, 150? Well, yeah. 17 is 200. And that one went up. Yeah. And then that one went all the way yeah. up. So but yeah. I would say this much. At that time, when I got those shoes, a lot of older people, like, me, like even older than me, mm -hmm. then mm -hmm. was saying, they say, listen, I don't like new Jaws, but I tell you what, yeah, I like them. Yeah, like that. That seventeen was a little different, and when that and to me, like the only reason why I'm not going crazy, crazy, crazy right now, I'm a little upset about it. 
is that it's not that red and white one. Now, I ain't going to tell yeah. no lie. I'd be nothing up if that red and white came out. <laughs> and I wouldn't able to get that red and white. They hype that red and white one up like that. Yeah. Boy, I'd be, let me tell you That's something. what's going to happen. Man. I would be mad. Like, when I say mad, I would be big mad if I ain't get that red and white one. I hate to tell you, but that's what's going to happen because the only ones I would want are those mids. The, the ones that you can take the strap on and out. The ones you talked about. The, the black one, the red and white one. Yeah. The white, especially that white and blue one. With That's a wizard. You know, you can see them with the wizards. But yeah. They gonna hype those shoes like you said, putting the one through fourteen in the vault. I I wouldn't. I don't. I don't wish for that because it's still some things. Let me tell I you want. what gonna happen. What they are gonna do? If it, just hear me out. Okay. You put one through fourteen in the vault. Yeah. Now what you're gonna allow is you're gonna allow people to be able to appreciate the the higher numbers. But they. I'm gonna tell you what though. The kids like um a couple weeks ago when we was in school, I pulled out my stealth fifteens, and the kid they was like, "Dang, coach, you know those are Jordan fifteen. Like they got excited to see them because. People don't see them at all. Wait till they see that Carolina but, blue come out. Let yeah. me tell you something. Yes. I'm here to tell y'all yes. right now. Yeah, I remember the hype when around that. that. Carolina yes. blue 15 come out. Yeah. Yeah. Watch how crazy people go at. Just watch. Yeah. Just watch. People don't like 15s. Yeah. Nope. They watch don't. when this Carolina, you yeah. heard it here first. When this Carolina blue 15 drop, watch how the hype will be unreal on yeah. that one. Yeah. I can tell you. I'm going to yeah. tell you every shoe. From higher numbers that everybody gonna act crazy about, and when they come out them OG twenty threes, yeah. Well, okay, so we know we know what the Carolina Blue fifteen to do. What about that uh that that Flint Gray? Now you still got yours? Yeah, I still the, got mine. the OG. I, it'll do well. That, it that will Flint do, Gray. It'll do well. The yeah. Flint Gray would do well. Yeah. The, the Carolina Blue definitely do, would do right. well. Okay. And 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 even the Stealth did well. Let me tell you yeah. how I know the Stealth did well. Yeah. When the Stealth first retro. I go to the shoe guy. You know, we all got the same guy. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And I said, listen, when that shoe go on sale, mm -hmm. holler at me because mm -hmm. I know they're going to ride it by. I, I didn't... call a week later. I say, if shoe went on sale, he said, the shoe gone. I did not take that chance. <laughs> I did he not said, take that. I went, and, gone. I went and got mine. I, the same thing with the Obsidian. I didn't take that chance. I, the first day I had to go get it because I wanted to make sure. Because that was a January. Like, this was after Christmas and everything. Mm -hmm. I said, yeah, I need that. Because... But because of those two dropping that year, I expected the Flints and, and those Carolina, but they didn't come. So that's something I'm looking forward to. Hopefully, they down the road, they, they do pull those out because we, we need those, man. I think it's just something different. Yeah. Well, I'm going to tell you two more shoes that's going to go real stupid when they come out. Cherrywood 16. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Ginger, Ginger 16. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Those two yeah. are going to go yeah. stupid. When they yeah. Come. I can tell you that right now. Yeah, but yeah, that was pretty much uh you know sneaker news and you know catching y'all up where we at. But we gotta talk about this twenty twenty five lineup, my boy. Boy, did you see this? Boy, I told y'all <laughs> Nike and Jordan brand. Listen to me, they are full speed ahead. So what we got here, they coming out with metallic five. Yes, reimagine. Yeah, I, yeah, yeah. I I wonder what that's gonna look like. like. You, you, I can tell you now, man. It's gonna to be me. fine. Talk to me. Talk you to talk me. about a shoot. You already know what the real magic four look like. Yes. So yes, now we are gonna get yes, that five yes. and all level. And if they put that Nike Air, God forbid if they put that twenty three shorter people go already oh, short, short mm -hmm. tall. If they turn around <laughs> and reimagine this shoe, yeah, and put that twenty three on the side of yes. it too with the right font. Oh my god! With right. Listen, yes, yeah. Listen, I'm talking yeah. Nelly. Give yeah. me two power. Yeah. Listen, yeah. Duncan on Barkley and guess Detroit what else Pistons. It, guess what else it's yeah. gonna do? It is going to last. It's like that four. Oh yeah, shoes gonna last a long yeah. time. So yeah. I'm looking forward to that. Yeah. 2025. This all according to Z Sneakerheads. I done told y'all yeah. that man worked with Nike. He don't want nobody to know it. Yeah, he, he got too. He know, know, he know too, too much. much. But yeah, that that the Metallic Five and the next one that I'm very happy to announce. They coming out with that Grape Five, my boy. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Grape yeah, Five. Yeah, man. That's I'm 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 happy about it, but I'm a little disappointed because that was one of those ones you can wear out. And people, man, where you get them from? But 2013. But it ain't it ain't the same. Man, let me tell you about that shoe. No, no, I got to tell y'all about this shoe. Yeah, it ain't the same. I got to tell y'all. I got to tell y'all about this shoe. This shoe right here is hard as a brick. Listen. Yeah. He got him. I got it. Listen. You talking hard as a brick. Yeah. This. Yeah. Like, it. Listen. It ain't no word for the disappointment on this shoe. When they come back and we got that Nike hair on the back, my boy. Yeah. Ooh, but yeah. it's just it's just the fact of having it. You know what I mean? Because 
think about they're gonna come back with that shape. Oh uh, yeah, I'm with you. Listen. I'm with you. I you I'm think with you. double up? I'm I'm not. You know I'm not a double up guy. Listen, I'm not a double will, up guy. I, I'm gonna tell you like this: if I sell this one, at least get you know half. I, I I believe that's a double up. Cause listen, that I I can't. I'm be honest with you. I can't wear these shoes no more when they put the Nike on the back. I can't go back to the jump man. Listen. Nah, yeah, you're right. I can't you're go right. back to the jump man yeah. after we after yeah. we done we done man. Yeah, and and I got so many pairs with the jump man. I, I don't wear them anymore. You're right about that. Like, um, like when they come back out with these, of course you know we doing our thing now. But when they come back out with these, man, this is this is this is like a it's gonna be a nothing. Yeah. I, I'm not a double up guy, but you know what though? I was gonna talk about that too. Not being a double up guy, cause I whatever I get eventually I wear it. Um, but we we in 2025, but let's you know it's gonna be something that's coming out in 2024, like at the end of the year. I'm probably gonna I'm probably gonna double up on those. Oh, man. Let, let them yeah, know. I'm, let them know. Th- those Elevens, those those white and Columbia. I don't I don't mess with Legend Blue. I understand the copyright infringement or whatever they want to call it. That shoe is a shoe I've been asking for. That that's my personal all time favorite eleven. All time favorite. That's my so with me, and it wasn't it wasn't done right. I think I said it before. It yeah, wasn't it, it wasn't done sure. right. But the stuff that I'm seeing now, the pictures I'm seeing now, it looks like they did it right. They so for me, I think I'm a I'm gonna get those, uh, and I'm gonna have to double up on them. I'm gonna have to. That's just it's one of those timeless shoes, and you know, white. After a while, it gets dirty. So. I need to make sure I'm straight. I just, I'm going to leave them alone. Well, you know me. I get, I, I, I get your pad in. <laughs> they make the, them y'all y'all across the water going to be out in two months. And you know they already going to be on them. I told you. I can't wear no 11s because, you know, it, most people look at your shoe, at your feet, think your 11s fake because they making that many of them. They'll be all right. Like I said, I think my reputation is I mean, solid. On, you man. know what I'm saying? <laughs> but, but so I feel good. At the end of the day, though, man, I just yeah. can't do it. I can't do it. Yeah. Like I just, I just can't. Like to see the way how they just took that shoe and watered that shoe down. Like, yeah, yeah. They, they basically took a a, a a a shoe that was on a whole whole different level and basically yeah. made it a converse. Well, okay, like, everywhere. Okay, let me ask you this then. Yeah. So, do you think that we, I talked about those eleven lows, the, uh, the Space Jam lows, Jumpman Jam? Do you think that's a a, a preview of something to come? So, you know it is. Yeah, like because that's what two thousand. That's the only time it came back with that color colorway with Jumpman Jam. The only thing I think because they came with that low, you guaranteed at least five years before you will see yeah. talking. About. I don't want to wait that long. Yeah, man. you talk um, about five. You got about five years. Man. So if that's the case, then what else is left to do? A lot. They just gonna keep switching these colors up, and then eventually they'll give you what you're looking for. For, for on eleven, yeah. Because I mean, we got we got those we got those uh those forty five um everybody black want, and white. Everybody want them gamos, my boy. I I don't understand the hype. Listen, I I, I passed on those. I say yeah, everybody got their thing, but yeah. everybody want those. They want those gamos. Like like you got a lot of, and they got some new colorway. Cause let's just face it, like I keep telling y'all about these elevens. He's crossed the waters and came out with these crazy colors over yeah. the years. And and Jordan Brand and Nike just now catching up. It's an influence, yeah. It, listen. We might want to get paid off of it. No, right. I done seen these people come out. These, these cross the water got Miami Hurricane colors. You I seen those. I seen those, yeah. They got yeah. all these. That's what I'm saying. So yeah. they got a whole. Listen. Cross the water done showed Jordan Brand and Nike all these possibilities. And you think they not finna use them? Well, it's a, it's a lot of other stories. You know what I mean? You can do, you can do what ifs all day. What if... Because okay, MJ didn't play in the '96 Olympics. You in the summertime, you were between the 11 and the 12. Mm-hmm. There you go, right there. That's an idea for you. You know what I mean? If you want to, you know, give us something that that could what if all that other stuff. Nah, I got those gambles for my daughter. I didn't. I passed on them. I got the taxi 12s instead. And at the time, I looked at it and say, well, yeah, maybe I might have I might have messed up. But then looking back at it, I'm like, because that's a low. That was with the low patent leather. So doing the gamble with the, the the mid or the high pant leather, I mean, what difference? I mean, that shoe wasn't around. I let you have all those. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want them. Yeah. Uh, about it uh, okay. Yeah. yeah. I, you you're talking about a shoe that was like iconic to me. Yeah. Definitely that bread eleven to this day. It's a very yes. iconic shoe. Yes. Yes. Shoe yes. For me. yes. But yes. the way how these shoes have been watered down yeah. over the years yeah. and everything, I yeah. I can't personally do it. So yeah. Yeah, I'm not finna, I'm not gonna be big though. But let's get back to the 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 one shoe that got so much controversy for 2025. <laughs> I know what well, you're saying. Y'all know. I know what you're talking about. Once again, I had we talked about this months back. Yeah. We talked about 
It's still 10. And I said I wanted it back. And you said toe cap, no toe, toe cap. cap. Yeah. I said it don't matter as long as it's got good quality. Nah. All right. My next shoe is going to be the Jordan 10 Steel. Ooh. Toe cap or without toe cap? It don't matter. <laughs> I toe cap. Listen, listen. He, he said it don't matter. Toe it cap. Matter. Right. Toe cap. This, this one for this one, toe cap. All right. Definitely. So he want the toe cap. I don't have a problem with it. And, and I understand why he want the toe cap. I'll take it either way. I want the shoe. Uh, I got to have this particular shoe, but quit with all y'all people talking about the shoe would look good if it did have a toe cap, yeah, and that's nah, not original. Yeah, a, a lot. Listen, let me explain something to, to some people, not all. I don't have arguments with my uncles or great uncles about Converse and Chuck Taylors. You know right. why? Because that's their time. Right. They could tell me about Converse and Chuck Taylors and Dr. J's and all that. So why are y'all sitting around trying to tell an older person about how some original Jordans came out? Right. Who lived it? Who went through it? Right. Oh my God! Right. So right. that's my right. only thing. Listen, sometimes just pay attention. I'm not going to correct you. I'm going to let you just be wrong. You right. could be talking loud as I don't know what and wrong as a mother. Right. So I personally would like to see the shoe come back. But I just need that quality. No, you definitely, definitely the quality. But because it's, they did us wrong, y'all know I did yeah. us wrong. But it's not only just that though. Okay, you look at the outsole, the the jump man on the original one. It was a different color. It was a different color. That was that, uh, uh, aqua turquoise. Yeah, the, the insole yeah, yeah, was yeah, a yeah. different color. You know what I mean? So the, with Nike Air on the insole. So talking about this. Yeah, right the, here. The, the, the on the outsole. Yeah, but on the insole too. Yeah. It, the whole insole was that that teal or aqua, whatever yeah. color it was. With Nike, so it's it's so many other details than than just the toe. Don't just don't give me this shoe and slap the toe cap on it and say because that's they will do that. You they will me, they like they will do that. Three, they eighty eight three. Yeah, they and still had joint on the bottom. <laughs> in the bottom, oh, yeah, man, so. be for real. But yeah, yeah, you know, we back in this thing. I just yeah. wanted to uh, talk about uh, upcoming shoes. It's been yeah. a minute, but always remember over here, we keep the body tight, feet right. Later.